Well, happy Monday, everybody. It is just about dinner time. Dinner in the South is lunchtime to most of y'all. So, <laughs> little update on yesterday's video. Uh, the available knives. These are the only two left. The Creek Skinner with the stabilized red cedar and the no name little handy knife. Only two left. Interested? Uh, email. Email is right down in the description box. I'll put it at the very first item on there. Set those out of the way. Now, tomorrow morning is where I am anyway in Florida is uh, the primary voting day. Not to get too political, but I'll just tell you if you live around in Florida or if you live around here, go vote. If you don't, you have absolutely no right to say anything about anything. Now, ours here tomorrow is the primaries for county commissioners, school board people, all the local stuff, plus the big one, which I think everybody knows where I stand. And uh, I'll do another video in the morning as I'm headed to the polls, just a couple miles up the road, our polling place. Uh, it's very important. I have actually blocked people and took people off of my Facebook that uh, at one time I consider friends because they want to fuss, but they do not want to go vote. They don't have time. They have time to go out and eat. They have time to go play bingo. They have time to sit in front of the TV all day long and watch these ridiculous TV shows. If that's the kind of person you are, and you're on my Facebook, just get off. I just, just get off. Don't talk to me. Maybe that's harsh, maybe it's not. Uh, especially right now, this is very, very important that we all vote this year. doesn't matter on which side you're on. If you think the other side is better, go vote. Go say something about it. Uh, if you're on our side, which is the majority of us, which this will be a landslide, but um, go vote. Don't sit at home thinking, well, it'll be okay. Everybody else will do it. Get off your butt and go vote. Now, just watched um, my good friend BC Trucks video. I agree 100%. I have been following that same story he was talking about, uh, bandvideo.com, or bandvideo.video, whatever it is. I have seen that video. I saw it early, early yesterday morning. Yeah, they took it down, but it's still available in a few places. Just go watch it, and uh, make up your own mind. It's pretty obvious, pretty clear, but... Um, Anyway, that's enough of that. Go vote. Now, I mentioned yesterday I had some uh, chicken choppers roughed out at the forge. There's one right there. I've got the rough grind done on it. And see, here's the other one. I've still got to do the rough grind on it. And I'm going to do the rough grind right quick. Now, I just thought the owner of these might like to see a little bit of how it's done. I'll rough it, then I'll drill it. And then I'll grind it some more, and then we'll get the heat treating done. And I think I'll just show you the whole process on one of these, and they'll both be done the same. And at the same time I'm roughing out all these, Say hello to another little friend. Look at that. Now this cleaver is modeled after a Dexter, an antique Dexter cleaver, made for 
some serious, serious chopping and processing on large animals. Deers, cows, hogs, that kind of type of thing. Now that is for, this is one thing that's for a very, very good friend of the shop. Very good friend of mine. Has uh, supported me over several years, a bunch of years. And I'm going to try to surprise him with it, but I'm also going to say we're going to call him Mr. Cool. Because he's a cool guy. Anyway, that's one of his things. The other one will be done at the forge probably Tuesday morning. Tomorrow morning after I get back from my uh, boating thing. They open at 7 o'clock. I'll be there at 7, like we are every year. Mama will go with me, of course. Uh, my kids have already voted on the early voting thing. Where you go down to the courthouse and do your vote there. I prefer to go on election day and show up face to face with whoever might be there. So, um, anyway, we'll show you a little bit of that in the morning. Don't want to get off on that again, but most of y'all understand where I'm coming from. So, let me get this one roughed out. And the next clip will be grinding. It will be loud, so watch your volume. And I'll be right back.
and there we have it. Chicken chopper roughed out. Two of those. Now I'm going to go ahead while I'm here, rough out my little friend. And I ain't going to video that because it's the same exact thing. Cool. All right, let me show you how I get the the uh, location for the pinholes. Now, a lot of guys will take calipers and measure and square. Everything's got to be perfect. That's not the way I do it because these are uh, one of a kind rustic type knives. So, in the end here, on both of them, we want a big hole. Probably a 3 8 in the end. That's so you can hang it up somewhere. And let's see, I'm just going to eyeball. I want a pin there. A pin there. And a pin there. And down here on the end, we want another 3 8 hole. So you can hang it up that way if you want to. Now the guys that measure them out perfect, that's absolutely ain't nothing wrong with that. That's that's cool. If that's the way you do it. Put a hole there. And we can sort of match them up like this. Pin. 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 Just like that. same way here I've already marked out a spot there for the big hole now this one being big as it is very heavy we'll go pin 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 and we'll do another pin and then we'll put our big hole down here like that I have four pins in this one instead of three which three would hold it, but four just looks a little bit cooler. There we go. Now off to the drill press. And we'll get all these drilled out. And then we'll start cleaning up the surface over on the big sander. Alrighty, next step. I got the small holes drilled. And uh, these two. The larger holes won't drill. I'm going to have to anneal it. Sometimes you can drill them without annealing uh, to soften the steel, and sometimes you can't. Uh, same with this one. I got two of the smaller holes drilled, and the rest of them won't drill. And that was with a fresh, fresh ground drill bit. So, they'll have to go out to the forge, be annealed, and that will take the rest of the day. Excuse me. There's that lisinopril medicine cough again. Anyway, I'll do that and we'll pick this back up tomorrow. I have a couple of sheaves to try to get done this afternoon. I'm getting about ready to go sit down, so uh, what I was gonna say, just saw an email. I know Ryan, I know. Uh, when y'all watch the ads that come up on my channel, I we as YouTubers cannot control the ads. We don't know what's there. So, but they play the ad. They pay me a nickel. That's a nickel they don't have to spend against us. So, there you go. <laughs> Alrighty, thank y'all for watching. Thank for your support. We'll pick this back up tomorrow or the next day. And I'll show you some more.